Hello, my friends. My name is Dadcraft73, and welcome back to another episode of our 1.15.2 Vanilla Minecraft Let's Play series. I hope you're having an amazing day. Is it getting to be nighttime out here? Yeah, it is. Hey, we have a little bit of work to do, and then it's going to be super fun villager moving time. Um, listen, I read every one of your comments. Now, sometimes I just don't have time to respond to them all. I try to. Ah, I fail a lot at that, but um, I do read every single one, and um, some of you guys were concerned that the location of my iron farm over here that we spent all this time working on may not be quite the way it needs to be because of this cliff. You remember there was a cliff that came the whole way across here, and I'm working on clearing it out, so I just wanted to bring you guys back and let you know that this is what I was doing over here. It's just going to take a little while, I bet 30 minutes. 20 minutes it's going to be done i mean it's not really that much right so we're just going to cut this all the way back and because i think i don't know what the radius is but we needed like eight blocks so if i go right here so one two three four five six seven eight it takes me back here and we're and i could even cut a little bit more out and this is going to be the closest one right so i think we'll be okay um and if not if we have some golem spawning over here where they don't belong we'll just take care of it you know we'll make it spawn proof or do whatever we need to but i don't mind cutting this back because we could just extend our little retaining wall and man i think it looks good i love that <laughs> i really do i like this it's a super simple little design but i think it looks great running across there and if we just need to extend it a little bit further oh man i'm down here in these steps we can do that without a problem so what i need to do is just clear out all of this stone get rid of all these blocks whatever they may be there might be some coal or something i'll take whatever i can get and then i think we're going to be in prime villager moving mode um, I think 16 by 16 by 8 centered on the villager. So the villager is going to be sitting right here under this block. So it's got to be 8 or whatever. So we'll figure it out. I think we're going to be okay. I think this will solve the problem. Um, if everything, that if I take all of this down to essentially ground level, which is just a couple rows, then we should be in good shape. So I'm going to work on this, and then I've got I've got a plan. Here's my plan. Um, I... I really can't ask you what you think about it, but just so you can think about it between now and when uh, we come back, is I'm going to build like a ramp, like a staircase down. I'm not sure exactly where. Probably here, right? Down to this level where all these crazy guys are, right? And then I'm just going to back a minecart down there and shove one of them in it and shoot it up the way. That's my high-tech plan. <laughs> I'm sure that it's going to work perfectly, and there's going to be zero problems, and we'll have villagers in there in, like, two seconds. What we do have to be careful is that dang villagers don't go, like, trying to run away and skating all around. Oh, man, such a disaster. But we'll get it figured out. I, I have faith in our ability. Notice if it doesn't work, I just said our ability, so if it doesn't work, I can blame you guys too. I'll be like, hey, why didn't you tell me that it was going to be something different? Anyway, that's what we're going to work on. i got to do some clearing. I'm going to knock that out first because I would like to get this part of it done. And then it's just a matter of um, taking care of the villagers. And hopefully by the end of today's episode, we're going to be swimming in iron. They say that this farm design... Um, and I linked it in... I'll probably link it in this the description of this video. We never want to take anything that is not ours and try to claim that we came up with it this is not my iron farm um there's a link to the original creator a uh, chap chapman i think i don't know i'm digging but anyway i'm gonna finish clearing out all of this stone here and then i'll bring you back when it's time to start moving villagers yeah okay i'll see you in just a second Alrighty, my friends, we are back. Okay, that didn't take too long. I mean, it was just literally a few minutes. It wasn't that big of a deal. But we got it all cleared out, and I think that's going to make it okay. And if it doesn't, I mean, we can always cut it back a little bit more. I mean, whatever, right? We can, we'll take care of it. Whatever needs to be done, we will do it to make a successful iron farm. Um, I've also got my first, uh, like, oh, you know what? No, no, no. Oh, I got to deal with that too. Okay, let's deal with let's deal with one thing at a time. I don't know how to get out of here. <laughs> we do have a little bit of an issue there. Um, okay, let's just go like this, and then we'll try to remember to tear it back down. Okay, so the first thing you guys are insisting—I thought I got them all open, 
But you guys were insisting in the comment section that there is a uh, a miss uh, a gate, a fence gate that is uh, open, I guess, or closed, I guess, is what the problem is. So we are going to go take care of that um, first before we start transporting villagers around. I don't think it matters. Oh, the other thing we need to do. Hmm, okay. Well, we got to get some zombies too. Okay. But anyway, so I've got my first set of scaffolding that goes up there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so here's what I want to do. I want to go here and here and get in here like so. We're going to drink this. Put this away. And then we're going to go down here. Okay, I don't see any closed fence gates. You guys said one of them was closed. Open. Open, open. There's nothing closed in here. Oh, there? <laughs> okay, maybe. maybe <laughs> okay, alright, we fixed it, right? So we should be good now. Oh, how am I going to get out of here? Dang it. Okay, um... Oh, I should brought some glass with me. Okay, can we go that way? Yeah, we can go that way. And then this just has to point that way. Okay, there. That should be fixed now. They should all be open. Okay, yeah, you know. I listen to what you guys say. I don't necessarily always like what you say because I don't like to get called out. But, you know, when it when you have to fix your stuff, you have to fix your stuff. Oh, look, it's one of these crazy things. Hmm, that's the last thing we need right now. They're all standing there trying to shoot me. That's okay. We're going to essentially ignore them, I think. Or do we have to fight them? Do we have to fight them? Oh, man. All right, let's deal with this mess. I, um, no, it's okay. All right, we need to get like some kind of bow or something. Those guys are dumb. <laughs> we're gonna get, we're gonna do this trick. I don't know, I don't remember whose video I saw watching this, but you don't want to kill that guy, the standard bearer or whatever, the guy with the banner, because if you kill him, then you get this crazy like bad omen thing or something on you, and that's no good. But I think what you can do is instead of like shooting him or doing physical damage to him, you can light him on fire. And that's like the same as... I mean, he'll go away then. Oh, did he already disappear? Don't be shooting my villagers. Oh, man. They're not going to shoot my villagers, are they? I will put the hurt in on you guys. You will wish you never even know... That's how dumb these villager things are. They're shooting each other. Okay, you're instantly all dead. We didn't get anything good from them. Okay, I guess that standard guy would have disappeared. Okay, so let's build our ramp. So here's, here's our deal. So we just need to keep on going down. Then we'll come back and fill all this in, of course. Okay, where do we want to want it to right here? Let's just dig this down. Okay. Um we have to be really careful here because we do we cannot afford to have like a hundred villagers skating all around the base. Okay, it's not very deep though. Okay. Okay, so let's go down a couple more.
Okay, it's gonna go down one more. Okay, okay. How in the, how in the world are we gonna do this? All right, let's go get rails. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do this, just temporarily, so we don't have to keep tearing that down. Okay, so now we need to go get some rails. And hopefully, and then we have to make sure that we take care of the top part of this too. So let's get the rails put in. I think we have enough. I don't think we need anything too crazy. So let's see. We need crafted items. Nope, crafted items. We have six powered rails. I don't know if that's going to be enough to get them up there. Let's make some more with these. Uh, no, let's put these away. Let's get this, and then we'll see. Got some sticks. Yeah, let's make some more levers. Hopefully that's enough five levers. It'll be close, I think. Alright, and then I need a minecart. Okay. I'm gonna need maybe some slabs. Let's see. I'm gonna need these anyway. Let's grab those. Let's put some of our cobble away. We want to keep some, though. Yeah, let's keep, like, two stacks out. That should be good. And then we have these other blocks we can mess with. Okay, so, um... Rail? How do we make powered rails? No, these. It's gold, a thing, and a stick. Okay. Alright, so let's go here. One, two. Uh, gold. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then a piece of redstone like this. Okay. And then we'll make sticks. Then we'll make some more power rails. Okay, so now we have those. All right, so let's figure out how we can make this happen in a very, very... Oh, you know what else I want to get? Um, I want to get some glass. Okay, get glass. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, so first of all, let's go up... Let's eat something. How's the day time? Not great. We should probably just wait. I do need... To, we're going to have to spend some time at night to get some zombies. Uh -huh. And we're going to have to work during the night as well. But that'll be later, I think. Okay, let's sleep. Alright, so the plan is, is just to find a way to get these crazy guys in here without letting like the entire world go all crazy and start running all around, right? That's not what we we don't want that. Okay. Let's jump down here and over here and let's at least get our rails in. Okay. So I think what we'll probably need to do is we'll probably need to do some boosting. So maybe like this, 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 that. That's going to be a pretty good boost. And then we can get these guys. Nope. These guys, regular rails. And maybe that's enough to go... Okay, and then we got to turn. Okay. And then I'm hoping that's enough. Do we need another one here? Probably. Okay. And then this one, this one. Can I put that on there? I can. Okay, good. All right, so what I would like to do is I want to stop the minecart, if possible, from going back. Okay, hopefully that will stop it, maybe. I don't know. Okay. I wish I had a little bit more room. This first one's going to be a little, little, little difficult, but I think we can figure it out. Okay. And then I, I don't want the, I want, I want this thing to stop like right there. Okay. Now we got to get some cobble again, and now we got to make some like safety rails, some bumpers. Ok, 
Okay, for now... Okay, so if we can get that, get our guy in there, right? If we can get him in there without him like carting back down, I'm afraid he might want to like come flying back down. And then I can break the thing. Yeah, I can go up here, right? We can break the thing and then hopefully get him down in there. Okay, so we got to do that three times. Okay, so that's step one. Okay, we're gonna go like this. Okay, those are all powered. 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 Uh, which one? Where does this actually sit? Here? Yes. Okay. Okay, good enough, right? All right, now we just have to do the rest of this, which is this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. All right, and then I think we probably want some sort of powered rail happening here. Hello, gentlemen. I wonder if I can do the old pick them up in the corner trick that we used to do back in the day. Okay. Oh, hey, hey, what are you doing? little rat thing just went skating away oh my goodness where oh where's where did you go whatever all right i'm just gonna let that guy go all right so i think all right here's my plan i don't know if this is gonna work or not we need a bucket all right so look all of these guys are just like over there i'm gonna jam them up into this corner that guy's way over there running around I, mean, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Okay, let's try the bucket thing and see if that works. Like, we don't have a guy in there, do we? No, okay. So I can jam them all into that corner. That might mean some babies might go running away. Oh, dang it. This is going to be a nightmare. I can tell it right now. Let's go get our bucket. We just put that bucket away, but that's okay. Okay, here we go. Oh, you know the other thing that I would like to do? Here, let, while we're here, because we're going to need these eventually, let's get like one, two, three, four of these, and let's make some more sticks, and let's make some more torches there. Okay, because I, I definitely want to lay some torches around as we're going about our business here, especially along up on top of the farm. Okay, all right. So now let's go grab some more. Let's grab a little bit of water. Okay. Hello. Crazy villagers, I am here to um, flood your little house. Oh, hello, hello, oh, uh oh, please let me get away. Oh, oh I'm, I'm trapped in here by a million villagers. Oh, oh man, come on, I'm serious. Let me go up that ladder. Oh, please, please. Get out of the way! Oh, what happened? What is all this collision? P please, please let me out! Go! I'm trying to come through. Stop blocking me! Get out of my way! Oh my goodness! I would drown you all, and then you will know what's up. Oh, don't swim up. Okay. I'm just trying to move you out of my way a little bit. Okay. 
I want him to be all jammed into this corner. Like that. Okay. Oh, that was a nightmare. Do I have a villager in my cart yet? We're about to have a huge disaster on our hands. Okay, how do we keep these guys from leaving? Okay, so if we go like this. Alright, if I break this open. Okay. If I break this, there's going to be villagers pouring out all over the place. Right? No, 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 no! You, oh, I hate you, villagers. I hate you so much. Okay, okay, we got one. You guys have to get back. He's not going to come back, is he? No. Please, can I get out? How am I ever going to get out of here? Oh, I'm stuck. Oh. Okay. Back up. Start swinging. I'm about to get my... Okay. Where's our guy? Okay. Is he up here? Okay, okay, okay. That works so far. Okay, okay. Okay. Please go. Oh no, I don't want to go in there. No. I'm stuck in here forever. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's your new home. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, village number one is in there. All right, now we got to do that same thing again. Oh my goodness. Okay. No, please, please, please come back. Please come back. Okay. I don't know what to do. I'm about to have like a meltdown. Oh, villagers. Okay. Stop that. Gonna stop the pressure. Maybe they'll back up a little bit. I mean, it's gonna be nighttime. Oh my goodness, we're gonna have zombies everywhere. We're gonna have like a crazy villager infestation. Oh, please hurry. Please hurry. So. Oh my goodness, we have to do that 17 more times. <laughs> oh, plus a couple of zombies. Oh my goodness, okay. Okay. Alright, so the question is, how do we... How are we going to do this? Oh, I got a villager. Okay. Oh, that seemed to work. Okay. Okay. Okay, there's two. Hey, no, no guy. No. Please go up. <laughs> oh, oh. 
Oh, but my goodness, what in the, what in the green hills am I gonna do here? Can you please go? Okay. Why did that? Oh, now I'm stuck down here again. Oh no. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's okay. I can break. No! Where's the guy in the cart? Go. Can you please go? Okay. Where's my do? Oh, why are you back? Oh, it just washed away all my. Oh my goodness! I don't know what to do. <laughs> oh man! I hate villagers. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm sorry. You're. Listen, when I tell you to get out of my way, that's what I mean. I don't mean you stand there and back talk me. Okay. Okay, now you have to go. I swear, if he comes carting back down here, we're going to have a huge problem. Okay. Okay, yes. Okay. So that worked. We just have to get another guy now. Please come back down. Okay, got that guy. to go in there guy I hate to inform you okay okay they're all in there okay okay so now, okay, I just gotta make sure the next time we do it right, we have to go all the way out to the end.
All right, so I think, oh my goodness, this video is already like crazy long, but whatever. We have to figure this out. We have to do, do the thing, okay? So we're going to go like this. We're going to go like this, and we're going to have a little climbing up thing, and then this is going to go here. So the villager's going to go through. Okay, that should work. All right, now, the only question that I have is, will it make it over this hump? We do have a little bit more power that we can use to give this guy a little bit more of a boost. Okay. All right, we have our cart. All right, let's see if we can make this work. Nope. Oh, that was a bad idea. No, come back! Go back down there. I don't care if you're mad or not, guy. Where's my thing now? Oh, it's way up there. Oh, I hate that guy. No! Oh, you're just going to climb up here? Okay. Hi. I'm just here. Don't worry about me. Okay. All right, that worked. All right, let's just do... Okay, so this is what I'm going to be doing for the next however long. I'm sorry, I had to get, get a little riled up at some of these villagers. They're acting a fool. They won't pay attention, and they deserve to get hit with whatever they get hit with. I didn't tell them to go crazy. They just decided to go all buck wild. And it's not right, but whatever. It is what it is. Hello, I'm here to collect you. Oh my goodness gracious, I hate it. Please don't... Oh my goodness. I've got villagers. Some cat just showed up out of the blue. Now I got cats around here. Oh my goodness. I'll be back in a little bit. Alrighty, my friends. We are back. Okay, now it is actually the next day. This is, it's Monday. <laughs> Monday morning for me. And I'm getting ready to, I've got to get this video done and edited and uploaded before 1 o'clock. So I have a couple hours but this seems to be working okay. I don't know exactly why. Every once in a while we have a golem that gets stuck, but he doesn't stay stuck for long. Um, so here are the changes I had to make to the farm so far. I had to, I'm had i working on this right now, and I'm going to tell you about a couple issues that I had. That if you ever want to do this, maybe you can just say, Nope, I'm never going to make a farm like this because I saw my friend Dadcraft make it, and he almost went... Um, off the deep end <laughs> trying to deal with villagers there has to be an easier way I, I need to like look up like a tutorial on you know how to move villagers super easy and cool or something like that but anyway so here's the deal with our our iron farm um i had i had to cut this back a little bit and we're gonna have to like maybe round that off a little bit because it looks very artificial at the moment uh, but i had to cut that back a little bit because i had a couple golems Iron Golem spawning up here on the top of the farm. See, I don't know why these guys aren't spawning Iron Golems all of a sudden. Get to work, guys. So I had some spawning up there. Oh, yeah, there's... A, oh, yeah, one, two... There's, like, five. <laughs> um, and then I had a couple that were spawning down here underneath the farm. And the problem with that is when you have an Iron Golem spawn outside of the farm, the... Um, the, no more will spawn, right? Because they're in range of the farm, and the villagers are like, oh, okay, yeah, I've got... You know, uh, I don't need to spawn anymore. I've got protection. So that seems to work. So that's no good. So I had to cut... I was getting ready to start recording, and literally an, an Iron Golem spawned right in front of me up here on this corner. So I took that back a little bit. I think this is safe. It seems to be. I don't think we have any. We'll just have to keep an eye on it. Um, and then I cut down the underneath here one block. And I think what we're going to do... I mean, I guess I can kind of keep that there. 
I mean, I sort of feel like we should just lower the whole thing, but then we've got, like, weirdness there. I mean, we could probably do that, as opposed... I was smelting up a whole bunch of glass in preparation for... I mean, I guess we could just leave it like that. I mean, because... Maybe we can make it not feel so unnatural? And they could just cut it along there, and then... I don't know. I think we need to do something, though. I don't like the way that that looks. I'd rather have it nice and squared off. I'd rather put these this dirt back in here. And then just have something there so we can say, yep, this was done on purpose because it looks better. And I've got a whole bunch of glass smelting up. Is it getting to be nighttime? Yeah, let me just put the rest of this dirt in quick. So I'm going to make a whole bunch of cactus green glass and just cover the ground, I think in that spot. Let's go up here and sleep through the night real quick. So this farm is operational. I haven't really checked the rates. I mean, I'm uh, we've been spawning tons of iron golems and everything seems to be okay. I was a little bit worried that um I mean, let's just be real. Um you know how like you see like a movie, <laughs> you see a movie and and you know, it's got like a dog or a pet or an animal and something happens in the movie where that pet or animal gets har hurt. You know, as far as the movie is concerned. And um, they always say, no animals were harmed in the production of this movie. I would love to tell you that that is the case with this iron farm. Um, it's not the case. I killed many villagers out of just pure, unadulterated rage. <laughs> I mean, I was, I was, there were things, yeah, it was a, it was rough. It was 100% rough, that's for sure. Um, bad things were happening in our villager iron farm creation. Um, I don't recommend it. I think that you would be better served if you decided to never ever make one of these in your entire life. Because all it does is it leads to... It's like the... It's like the you know what it is? <laughs> it's like the, the dark side. Iron farms um, lead to hate. And hate leads to suffering. <laughs> and that's exactly what I was feeling making this crazy farm. Okay, let me just get some of this, and then I'm going to go over here and get some dyes. And we'll get like one, two. That's probably plenty. Let me put this crazy thing down. I was cleaning up stuff over there. I'm going to put this in there and that in there. And then a little bit of iron. Okay. All right. So um, let me just show you what we're going to do here. And then I'm going to, I don't think we're going to do this on camera. I just got to get it knocked out. Uh, but my smelter should be done. I, I went over to the desert and got, I don't know, 20 stacks of sand or something like that just a few minutes ago. And they should all be done. Yeah, they're all finished. Oh, it's not 20, but um, 1, 2, two three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's start with 8 maybe. And we'll make it just a bunch of glass. And it'll sort of mat it'll sort of blend in. It's better than the lime. But I think this is gonna work. And if nothing else, it'll give us a marker. Oh, now we also that now that's the other thing. I've got random cats rolling around the house now. I guess because the villagers think that they're in some kind of farm or something. Or they're in a village. And the game wants to not only give me iron golems, but it also wants to spawn crazy cats. I'm like the crazy cat man of Minecraft. All right, let's go like this and just we just put in a couple of these so we can see what it looks like. We don't have to do everything. I mean, I think it's it's not going to look great, but you know, it's an autumn an our an iron farm, so you know, we have to do what we can do, I guess. One, two, three. Okay. Let me just run these out here the rest of the way. I have a feeling that what I'm going to want to do is put dirt under all of this. Let's not, um, yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'll work on that between the episodes, and then we'll be able to come back and be like, yeah, this is cool. Okay. Yeah, I mean, not not, not ideal, but at least, I mean, it looks okay. It looks kind of industrial, and it matches. I do every once in a while have an iron golem getting hung up up there. I don't really know how to fix that. Can I just knock him a little bit? No, he's going to come attack me now. So, I mean, while this farm is fully operational, I mean, it could definitely, certainly be a little better, I think. This little pond has been very helpful. <laughs> You're instantly dead. 
Well, not instantly, but you are dead. Okay, so, I mean, it works. I'm happy. Um, let's go down and just check how much iron we actually have. Get rid of those, as we can run down here. I don't know, it's probably been a couple hours, right? I mean, I had to go to bed. Yeah, look, so, one, two, three, four, five, plus a little bit more. And there's more golems coming in at all times. So, I mean, I think we're going to be in pretty good shape. I think we're going to be able to get a beacon pretty soon. And it's all worth the effort now that it's done. But I don't recommend building this farm to anyone because it's enough to make a man crazy. Or a woman. Or a kid. Or anybody. <laughs> oh, Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it so much. Until next time, please remember to be cool. Don't be a fool. And from my 1.15.2 Vanilla Minecraft Let's Play series where we're farming iron like a boss. I guess we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.